Hi students, this is Alex here. The problem is solve d square plus 1 into y equal to 0 and they have given some condition. The condition is used to find the unknown constants. First, let's write the auxiliary equation where we replace capital D as small m. So, m square plus 1 equal to 0. From this, m square is equal to minus 1. So, m is equal to plus or minus root of minus 1 which is nothing but plus or minus i. So, when we write this in the complete form, it is 0 plus or minus i. So, it is of the form alpha plus or minus i beta. By comparison, we know alpha is 0 and beta is the number with i. The number with i here is 1. So, the complementary function as per the rule is by formula e power alpha x into c1 cos beta x plus c2 sin beta x. By replacing the value, we get e power 0x. Then c1 cos 1x, that is nothing but cos x, plus c2 sin x. We replace beta also. And the other side of the equation, we have 0, so there is no particular integral. Therefore, the solution y is cf plus pi. In this, there is no particular integral. So, y is e per 0 x is 1. So, we left with only c1 cos x plus c2 sin x. So, we got the solution. But, they gave some condition. That is, y of 0 equal to 0 means that is y of 0 equal to 0 means when x is 0 actually this value represent x so when x is 0 and y equal to 0 here so when x is 0 y is 0 this is the condition we are going to substitute in the solution so y we replace with 0 c1 cos 0 plus c2 sin 0. From this, we get 0 equal to cos 0 is 1. So, we left with c1. And sin 0 is 0. So, totally it is 0. From this, we come to know the value of c1 is 0. Now, we will replace this in the solution. When I replace this c1 as 0, we don't have the first term at all. So, y equal to c2 sin x. Using one condition, we got the value of one constant as 0. Now, to use another condition, it is y dash. So, it means we need derivative of this. So, y dash equal to c2 into cos x. According to this condition, y dash of 0 equal to 1. So, y dash of 0 equal to 1 indicates when x is equal to 0, this value is x we get y dash equal to 0. By substituting this, we get y dash 0 equal to c2 into cos 0. Sorry, this y dash is 1 here because this is x value and this one is y dash value. Now, we are going to replace this in the equation. y dash is 1 equal to c2 cos 0. Cos 0 is 1. So, from this we come to know C2 value is 1. By replacing it here, actually we need the solution y. So, here we get y equal to C2 is 1. So, we left with y is equal to sin x. So, we got the general solution which is in terms of the constant. Using the given condition, we got the particular solution. So, the final solution of the given equation along with the given condition is y is equal to sin x.